So I'm here with uh, Silvia Simoni, who is uh, one of the uh, speakers to the conference All Inclusive here in Merano, and uh, she uh, brought the example and the very good practice of a smart proposal for transport in the Alpine region. So tell us, uh, Christina, why is this proposal smart and in what uh, does it consist? Um, so this proposal uh, comes from uh, all the association uh, from uh, the province of Boten and uh, of uh, Trento and so it's really a joint effort to to find uh, an idea that uh, takes into account all the needs uh, of the stakeholders that lives and go for tourism uh, along the road uh, in the mountain and especially in the region of the Dolomites. So first of all we uh, studied the problem because that's a complex problem and uh, we analyzed all the traffic data and uh, um, we also analyzed the needs uh, of uh, the stakeholders like people who live who, who have uh, like um, a restaurant or cyclist, motorcyclist, uh, tourists uh, uh, in general. And so we, the idea mainly consists in a smart regulation of the traffic where during two days per week, Friday and, Saturday, and Sunday, um, basically uh, bus will allow to uh, go through this the mountain roads uh, between 9 and 12 so that they can bring their tourists uh, uh, um, in, uh, in these nice uh, landscapes and the tourists can visit, uh, can wander, can also have a beer in, at a bar and, and then from uh, 12 to 2 p.m. Uh, the buses cannot circulate anymore and uh, motorcycles and, uh, um, and auto and cars can access this road so that they will have like light traffic so no uh, heavy vehicle along the road and that can be a pleasure for them and they also can reach a restaurant and huts to have lunch in a nice landscape and then from 2 uh, to um, 5 uh, then again the buses can bring their their guests uh, down uh, in the valley whereas the motorcyclists and the auto will have to to wait until 5 when the the traffic will be again open uh, for them. And we think that this idea can really encounter the interest uh, and also the, the um, approval of more than one categories. And, and so the idea is to build an environment that is pl pleasant for all the people that will, uh, will go uh, along these roads. Because you were explaining us that uh, for the moment there is an incredible intensity of traffic. Yeah, yeah. Uh, at the moment, the data show that uh, the level of, of the noise is very high. It's as high as 90 decibel, and this was uh, basically measured along a campaign last summer, and, and this is really, really unpleasant. And, and also the intensity of the traffic in the sense of a uh, number of cars that pass. Yeah, yeah, that's about about uh, uh, five, that's about one car each uh, five minutes. Uh, mm -hmm. And um, sorry, that's about one car every five seconds, uh, yes, it's, which, it's... which is about uh, 5,500 uh, vehicles uh, per hour. Yeah, you see, this is to put an immense pressure on uh, on uh, on tourists. So basically, your idea, and uh, which is only a part of a very uh, larger proposal, is to come to a to a regulated traffic that can. But of course, you have to agree with all the stakeholders. So I guess, uh, how do you think that this uh, proposal yeah. <laughs> will be implemented? Will be done? Yeah, we are we are actually trying to speak with uh, all the the stakeholders and to try also to to basically uh, listen to their needs and try to to find a good uh, trade-off so that each one can have an advantage. So that's a kind of win-win strategy. That's the idea. Thank you very much and uh, we will keep in touch so you will tell us if this uh, smart idea for traffic in the Dolomites works. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. you, grazie. Thanks, bye.